Good Sunday, everyone. Today we're going to look at five minutes cool down stretches that you can do after your workout. So, first we start with uh, side lunges 10 seconds one side, 10 seconds opposite side, then slowly transition to overhead lunge stretches. So, stretching your hips, quads, and upper back. Then transition to hamstring stretch, reach your toes, so the back of your thighs stretching, so you're going to do it twice, then back again to hips and upper back stretch. Remember to take your time when you transition from one stretch to the other, do not rush, take your time, move slowly and try to do as far as you can. Do you feel the stretch on your muscles? Again, remember stretching is really important, especially after your workout. You want to stretch to reduce soreness, stiffness for your muscles and because it feels good. Why not? Also a good tip for reducing soreness and relaxing your muscle after a good hard workout is to take a hot bath with Epsom salt. You will enjoy it and you'll thank me later. Okay, next one is Cobra stretch. So stretching your lower back and your lower abs. Very good stretch and from there you transition to upper back stretch your shoulders, upper back holding it for 10 seconds. Remember you're doing this twice. Now with the arm under twist transition focus more on your shoulders. Number five single leg lying knee tack. So we're gonna hold you're gonna put your hands under your knees knees toward your chest and hold it for 10 seconds make sure you put some pressure and you really feel it towards your lower back and hips final twist again 10 seconds laying flat on your back and just twist to the side keeping your other opposite hands straight out Okay, once you have completed both sides of spinal twist, you're gonna sit up and do a reverse plank. Really good for the hamstrings, glutes, lower back, and your core. And make sure your palms are facing the opposite direction. Last time we did laying down spinal twist, this time it's seated spinal twist. All right, make sure you keep your back straight as you twist and put some pressure as you pull towards the opposite side. Alright, butterfly stretch. Okay, focusing on inner thighs. So use your forearms, top of your knees and press it down. Put some pressure so you feel it more. Then you transition to upper body stretch. So your arms up. So you stretch your arms, shoulders. Then you bring your forearms down. So you stretch your triceps. Do both sides and you're good. Last but not least, windmill twist. Again, twisting your obliques, your hips, and hamstrings all are being stretched at the same time. Thank you for watching. Stay safe and healthy, and I'll see you next time.